Well, continuing with the topic, continuing with the topic, we have the expressions prefer and would rather, okay? Or would prefer and would rather. We use would rather or would prefer, right? Check. Whenever we say would rather, we use the verb directly. Whenever we use would prefer, we use the verb in infinitive, adding the preposition to. Okay, so after would rather, we use the infinitive without the to. Example sentence, let's compare. Shall we go by train? If we use rather, you say, well, I'd rather go by car. Check, if we use rather, we say, I'd rather go by car. We're not using to without to. If we use prefer, we say would prefer to. So will, shall we go by train? Well, I prefer to go by car. Check. I'd rather go by car. I would prefer to go by car. Rather go, prefer to go. Okay, that would be the difference. So if somebody asks you, would you rather have tea or coffee when they give you options, would you prefer tea or coffee? Would you rather have tea or coffee? You can say coffee, please. Tea, please. Or you could say, I'd rather have coffee. I'd rather have coffee because it says would rather have. I'd rather have coffee, please. Or you can say, I prefer a coffee. You can say it directly without two. I prefer a coffee, please. Okay. Notice whenever we're are trying or saying the negative forms, we say the following, rather, not. Again, without the infinitive, we use infinitive without the preposition to. Example, I'm tired. I'd rather not. I'd rather not to go out this evening, if you don't mind. But if we use the same sentence with prefer, we would say, I'm tired. I'd prefer not to go. I prefer not to go out this evening if you don't mind. It says, do you want to go out this evening? Check. Do you want to go out this evening? I'd rather not. Or I'd rather not to. Oh, sorry. I'd rather not. And if it's prefer, I'd prefer not to. I prefer not to. I'd prefer not to. Okay. I'd rather not, short answer, I'd rather not. This, this is the short answer. Do you want to go out this evening? I'd rather not. Do you want to go out this evening? I'd prefer not to. Okay. Uh, do you want to have Chinese food? You can say, I'd rather not, or I'd prefer not to. If they ask you, do you prefer Chinese or uh, Italian food? Okay, do you want to eat Chinese or do you want to eat Italian? I'd rather not eat Chinese. I prefer to have Italian. You can use negative and affirmative. Okay, so I'd rather not or I'd rather not or I prefer not to, okay? Now the structure, I'd rather... Then, then you say the verb, then do something else. For example, here we have, I'd rather stay home, I'd rather stay at home than go to the cinema. I'd rather stay at home than go to the cinema. Same phrase, but with prefer. I'd prefer to stay at home than to go to the cinema. I prefer to. So that's basically the difference. Rather the verb, and prefer to, prefer to plus the verb, okay? Now to the final exercise, here, talking about food, whenever we're hungry, what would you like to eat? Or what do you want to eat? Remember, we use question, what would you like to? Check, what would you like to eat? Okay, would you like to eat? We say, would you like to, okay? You say, I'd like or I would like. So what would you like to eat? I'd like to eat some rice. I'd rather not have noodles. Or I prefer rice over noodles. I'd rather have rice instead of noodles. Or I prefer rice over noodles. 
Okay. Let's see. Chicken, fish or beef? Let's compare. Which one do you prefer? Chicken, fish or beef? Okay. You can say chicken is nice. I'd rather eat chicken over fish. Uh, but I prefer beef over all. Check. I'd rather have chicken over fish, but I prefer beef over all. If you say it like that, that says number one is beef, then chicken, and then fish. And that's actually my case. I prefer to have beef over chicken. Or I'd rather have beef over chicken. And my least favorite is fish. Fish is my least favorite. Okay. So we have another one. Would you like to have vegetables or soup? Would you like to have vegetables or soup as your side dish? Um, I usually prefer vegetables, but right now I feel like having a soup. Or you can say, I prefer a soup. I prefer a soup right now. Or I'd rather have vegetables. Okay, so we say it like that. Now, some phrases that we can use is we're talking about vacation expressions and all of these for eating and all of these for going out. We could give options. For example, if you're in Mexico City, let's go to a museum. Imagine one of the activities that we can do is go to a museum. So what, what museum would you like to go to? You can say, well, I prefer going to art museums instead of um, uh, so art museum instead of a um, fun museum or a funny museum. And somebody say, oh, I'd rather go to Replace Believe It or Not instead of a uh, Frida Kahlo Museum. Okay. For example, talking about our topics, for example, we can use, what do you prefer? Would you like to go to the beach or would you like to go to a big city? Um, well, I'd rather go to the city. I'd rather go to the city for the entertainment. There's a lot of museums. There's a lot of shopping centers. So you can say, I'd, I'd prefer go to the city. Or I'd prefer to go. Being, I'd prefer to go to the city. Or I'd rather go to the city. Okay? Or you say where do you want to go or where would you like to go to the beach or the city let's say Acapulco or Mexico City oh I'd rather go to Mexico City I'd rather go to Mexico City for the big museums and the big shopping centers and you can say I prefer to go to Acapulco for the beach or the other way around, okay? So we can use this, what would you like to eat? Where would you like to go? What would you like to do? So those are all questions that you can do. And for suggestions, you should, you should go. You should go to Mexico City and visit the Frida Kahlo Museum. That would be for a suggestion, okay? So until now, we finish with this. So. My question is, what would you like to eat from this last slide? With this, we conclude. So tell me sentences with rather or prefer. I'd rather have chicken over fish, or I prefer chicken over fish, or I prefer to eat chicken over fish. So make some example sentences with rather or prefer. And with this, we conclude. Have fun. Take care. I'll see you the next time. Bye-bye.